Hi, my name is Liz Fallon, and I'm playing the part of Lois Lane and Bianca. My name is Andrew Purcell, and I'm playing the part of Bill Calhoun and Lucentio. Simply enjoying Cole Porter's writing and text and everything that goes along with it. It's been yeah. so it's <laughs> it's just hilarious to watch everybody else do the work and have watch strong cast do the work as well. You yeah. know, um, but Tom Dever Harry's been a hell of a lot of fun. Yeah, and that's <laughs> probably my favorite. We started it. The Saturday of Parents Weekend, and it was how many hours? Like five or something? Four. 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 And it was just um, Andrew, Clinton, Keegan, Sean, and I, and Kevin in a room for like five hours, just laughing and joking and yeah. dancing. And that was probably that was probably my favorite. I have dropped her a couple times. Uh, oh yeah. We really <laughs> I know, we, we, we've been working on a death drop, and let's just say she... I have bruises. Um, well, another thing that's been really difficult, um, and of course with any kind of play, when you do a play in a play, yeah. that you have to know your character and then input him in the role that he or she is doing. And that's been quite, that's been difficult, you know, it's been a, it's been a first for me. I just know the best on that. That's, that's one of the biggest challenges I think about the show is that it's not it's not this cast of Millican students mm -hmm. playing the characters in the Taming of the Shrew. It's because my Bianca is different than Lois's Bianca. And so it's us trying to get inside our character as a Baltimore act like an actor in Baltimore playing the role of Shakespeare. That's Yeah. That's really hard. <laughs> <laughs> and fun. I think it this is like one of my fav my favorite types of musical theater. Is just I feel like it's it's got a lot of depth, but it's not like people see. Oh, I don't know how to articulate this. <laughs> I, okay, this I feel like everybody enjoys it. Like I mean, you can pull in an 80 year old woman from Decatur and have her sit next to my 12 year old cousin, and both are gonna love the show because there's lots of singing and dancing, and there's the classic Shakespeare text, and so that gives, like, fulfills the actor side, and the music is awesome. And Cole Porter and, um, you know, really quick with the jokes, and so is Shakespeare. Yeah. And so the two of them together, it's just. It's funny, it's enlightened, you start to care about the characters and you get to see the relationships and it's, I don't know, it's good.